and the next thing you know, man, I, I'm off in another room with this gentleman, and man, I'm crying. I'm crying for like an hour. It's 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 such a big impact on my life. Now, if you if you missed the beginning, I'm sitting in this youth choir at a church. Uh, I'm 13 years old. Next thing I know, uh, I just hear the message of the cross. You know, Jesus died, shed his blood, and arose again from the dead, was crucified for me, you know, died for my sins. And, man, I tell you what, it, it, I came down to give my life to the Lord, and, man, it was easy, man. I mean, it, I can recall the whole youth group, it seems, came down. But I know that I went to this room, man, after I received Christ as my Lord and Savior, and I cried for an hour. It was a very emotional thing for me. And, uh, you know, it changed me from that moment forward, being born again, again. <laughs> I can remember uh, Pastor Vihan, you know, in uh, the Manuel Baptist Church, man. I, uh, great memories there. You know, I was I was the problem child. I was the youth that, was, uh, that had issues. <laughs> you know, I come from the divided family. There was no Father Sunday for me. It was just, hell, I'm just hanging around, you know, I guess this guy will be my dad, you know, and they were. There was Ricky Surratt, uh, Mr. Bowler, guys, so many guys, man, in that church, man, was, uh, they they, they took me under their arms, man, and I appreciate that. But I always think it'll just be men's day. Hell, don't matter what, you know, whatever it is. But, hey, it's all good. Do I have issues about that now? <laughs> no, probably not. <laughs> Where's my dad? <laughs> no, our Heavenly Father never leaves us forsake us. And I love my dad. He taught me how to wa watch werewolf movies, man. I'd cling on to his leg, you know, them old ones where the werewolf would look away and old Lon Chaney come back, mm, you know, and he looked back from the and good back and he had more hair on his head, you know, so, you know, I hung on to my daddy's leg, you know, so I got those memories, you know, but I got a lot of great memories. I don't know what I was talking about, but all I can say is, man, when you're born again, you receive Christ as your Lord and Savior, it changes you, man. You're never the same, and that's what happened to me. Now, as life progresses, you know, my daddy ran a beer joint, you know, and, uh, you know, so I had those elements in my life, and I was a daggum pothead all the way through high school. You know, it's uh, just one of those things, but I always struggled. I always wanted more God, you know, and uh, but at the same time, I was, uh, you know, everybody else is doing these things, and man, my family, you know, that's hell, we raised in that kind of stuff, you know, they, they tried to keep it away from you know how kids are, they gonna see those things, and you know, and that's all I ever done, you know, and uh, but the whole time, all through high school, I did those kind of things every day, and uh, you know, but in the middle of 12th grade, I had a good friend, Norris Blackman. I didn't know him at the time, but uh, he changed the course of my life. When you're seeking after God, you seek after righteousness, you thirst after righteousness, you'll be filled. Uh, you, you know, it says that, and God's good. God knows how to keep you on track, man. You're in his hand, man. That's what's so wonderful about the gospel, you know. Uh, you know, Christ did it for us. That's what's so wonderful about this weekend. You know, the, the resurrection of Christ, man. He can rise in your heart. Man, it doesn't matter if you're dead by or whatever, you know, so, hey, man, I don't know about you, that's what happened to me, I hope that's an interesting story to you, I'll tell you more parts of it, man, it's a crazy world, religion, church, man, all those kind of things is a great foundation for me, but, man, it's a, it's a heartache for a lot of people, and, uh, you know, it's been a heartache for me, but I tell you what, through it all, man, Christ is the same, and that's who you gotta look to, uh, he'll change your life.